Okay, let's take a look at the neighborhood. I'm in a different vehicle than what I normally have. My car is in the shop. When uh, they uh, did the 90,000 mile checkup, it required a computer upgrade that did something to my engine, and, and I'm actually getting a new engine. This house is really well maintained. You know, it's a nice neighborhood. Seems pretty quiet. Pretty good pride of ownership. Most of the houses, you always got one. That's kind of questionable. We'll take a drive down this way first. came in. This is the neighborhood. This is a cul-de-sac a little bit next to yours. Nice big lots. You do not have big lots like this too much anymore. still having pretty good pride of ownership here. Kind of working class community. The house that uh, you're looking at is in pretty darn good condition. The uh, yard's in easy maintenance. Nice level land, looks like it got good drainage. seeing a lot of junk cars, trash in the front yards and things of that nature, so it's like a decent neighborhood. I don't see any tag marks either, you know, from gangs or anything like that. Okay, I'm going to turn and make a U-turn here, go back down the way we came. Let's see how tight of a turn this van can make. Well, not that tight. Yeah, okay. There we go. You know, I'm looking at the roofs. I see that, uh, Roofs are in pretty decent condition. Roofs are getting replaced as they need them. And when I say roofs, I'm mostly f f saying, talking about the shingles. Oh, there's a state trooper over here. This house in the corner belongs to a state trooper. It's always good to have a man of the law or a woman of the law in the neighborhood. Got a good neighbor, neighbor, neighborhood here. House is in good condition. We know they have one offer. I'm sure they'll have other offers. We're gonna, we're gonna need to go in with full price. I'm sure. Okay, that's the neighborhood. Big wooded area over here. Looks like it's got some trails through it. Nice place.